So I was sharing this sample course recently with an Articulate user, and the person I was talking with noticed that over here in the sidebar of the course, if you click on the Notes tab, there's some special formatting going on here. You can see that the font that's used in this first paragraph is kind of unique. In fact, it's the same font that's used over here in the course slides. And if we click on this hyperlink here to move to the next slide, we'll see that the same font is used here in the Notes panel. And in fact, it's used in a few different places. There's also some bullets that have been applied and you know some different colors on some key pieces of text. The other thing is the background of the notes area is a color other than white. It's a color that kind of complements you know, the content of this course. So the person that I was talking with was like, well, how did you get it to look that way? So I wanted to share with you how to do that because I think a lot of people aren't aware of how easy it is to make these kinds of customizations in the notes that you include in your sidebar. So let's talk first about the fonts and the colors of the text. The text that you see here in the notes panel comes from whatever you've entered in PowerPoint's slide notes pane. So if we go over to our PowerPoint file, and I just pull this border up a little bit so we can see a little bit better, down here in this bottom area is where the notes can be entered. And a lot of people do know this already, and a lot of people use that panel um, because they want to display slide notes in their course. But a lot of times people kind of stop there after they enter their text. The cool thing is you can format the text in that panel to look however you like. And you can apply the formatting in this view that we're looking at now if you want to. But the thing is, if you do that, not every change that you make is going to be as easily visible in this view. So if you're going to be doing some formatting of your notes text, you'll probably want to get a more robust look at things. And to do that, you can just switch to the actual notes page in PowerPoint. And to get there, you'll come up here to the View tab and then click on Notes page. And this gives you an editing environment where you can see and apply all sorts of formatting changes. In fact, it looks a lot like you know Microsoft Word as far as the text editing tools. Up here, you'll see a picture of your slide, but down here in the bottom is where you can do all of your changes. So if we zoom in here a little bit, you can see how easy it is to tell what's been done here already. You know, here's in this first paragraph that special font. You can see all the bullets that have been applied, and you can also see the different colors that have been applied to the text. So let's just experiment a little bit with a blank presentation that I've got here. Um, just got a couple of sample slides that we can play with. And all I've done here is pasted into the notes pane some practice text that we can goof around with a little bit. So let's just come up here to the View tab, and we'll click on the Notes page. And this is pretty much what it looks like when you first come here to this page. There's not really any formatting to speak of, but we can go ahead and get right to work. I've split this text out into a few different paragraphs. So for this first paragraph, let's just come up to the Home tab and we'll pick a different font. And we'll even up the size a little bit, maybe change the color. And maybe this next paragraph will apply a bullet, and then these other ones will apply numbers. And maybe we'll do a few things with the fonts here too, like this one, change it to something really obviously different, and make a few changes to some colors and maybe make some stuff bold. Okay, so we've made several changes here. Now the thing to remember is the default settings in PowerPoint are such that you won't see all of these changes when you switch back to normal view. So watch what happens. If we click the View tab and then go to the Normal view, Here's what our slide notes look like here. You can see that some of the formatting is obvious, like here's the bulleted paragraph, you know, and here's the couple of paragraphs that we applied the numbering, and here's the bold. But as far as a font change or a different color, you're not going to see that unless you change some of the default settings in PowerPoint, and we can get to that in another screencast. I wanted to show you, though, that what happens when you preview or publish this in Articulate Presenter is it'll pick up all of those attributes that you set. So up on the Articulate tab, we'll preview this slide and we'll get a look at what this looks like. Okay, so here's our slide, and if we switch over to the Notes tab, we'll see all of that formatting that we applied. So at a basic level, that's how easy it is to alter the appearance of the text in your Notes tab. In the next few screencasts, we're going to talk a little bit more about slide notes, and we'll look at how to use what PowerPoint calls the Slide Notes Master to kind of streamline your workflow and make it easier to apply um, specific text attributes across all or many of your slides. We'll also see how to change that background color of your notes panel to something other than white if you want to do that. So you can stay tuned and we'll talk to you in the next screencast.